Hello everyone, Sars RJ here, science hit the scales for another game of Carrier Command Gaia Mission. In the last video, we took over the island of Bacchus, or Bacchus, whatever, took over an island. I'm going to change this one to a mining, to a mining island as well. But anyway, the, uh, this island is, um, stuff. We've got stuff going on and other stuff. So yeah, um, things are happening, things are happening, things are shaking. And, um, everyone's going to die. Especially them. Especially the enemy. Right. Anyway, just doing a quick check with the carrier, making sure I've got a whole bunch of supplies that I need. Got it, want it, need it, must have it. I'm still producing armor mark one. Alright, so, uh, anyway, let's check the map. Oh, I was already checking the map. So the Isle of Endymion. This shouldn't take too long. Of course, we unlock the turbo boosters for the, um, for the walrus. So, we have... So now we can go... That, that means now the walrus can go over cliffs and stuff, but if I have to. Yeah, I could sell the Iron of Fulcrum right now. The problem is, the game can say, you know, Oh, you can't go to the Iron of Fulcrum, like, you know, Oh, the fence are too heavy! Let's go to another island, mate! I mean, we have to save all those shields! And I'll be like, eh... Can't be too hard to do so. Yeah, there's all the um, few more islands to capture. There's, so yeah, six, there's six more islands to capture before we can fall from. And, and just like Pokemon, I've got to catch them all. But anyway, moving on to Beacon. By the way, when um, I take up a fall from, that's my new supply point. It's going to be that for a while. Here we are, in the Mian. Sir, it's raining cats and dogs out there. Oh. Plus, we can hardly see anything. Might be a good idea to come back in the day or wait for the storm to pass. Ah, the scramblers. Definitely not, sir. If we leave now, the enemy may have enough time to prepare a more solid defense. Right, sir. So I'm getting a strong interference tell you that. from the island. The signal is scrambling our unit control transmission. From a quick analysis, the field appears to be comprised of several signals originating from scrambler systems at various locations around the island. Now, one, one thing is you've got to. Like when you look at the map, you can find which ones are the scramble. You can find what the scrambles look like. The command center, I think, is over here. Let's do the research lab. No, no, that's a scrambler. All right, so the scramblers have a um, kind of like those squares. So one of those is probably a scrambler, or maybe that's a scrambler. Yeah, okay, okay, maybe I'm not that great. My eyes are not that great. Training it. But one of these structures is probably going to be a scrambler. So. What else when it comes when it comes to scramblers is that you um yeah, when, when it comes to scramblers, your attack rate is very, very short. You don't know what you don't know where to um you don't you don't know um you can't really go very far. Oh, we've got back guns now for the oh, only three back guns though. And of course as per tradition, as per military tradition of taking out the dock. Which I should have aimed for. Docks destroyed. Docks for. Anyway, docks are down. So now it's time to launch the um. It's time to launch the Manta with the laser. All right. So as you can see, I can't really see anything. <laughs> but there are scramblers in the local area. Zap, zap, zap. Yes, your quad cannons are no match for my lasers, General. Heat <laughs> laser. Alright, lasers. Heat lasers, turret. Heat lasers, uh, quad cannon. Or machine gunner. I don't know which one to quit. Yeah, I've only had shields on this thing. But we got a shield on this thing. Let's really use them. Alright, so you don't want to go too far because the enemy um, actually, like, as you can see, the screen is all static -y, and if you just go out of range, your vehicle, you lose all contact with the vehicle. Plus, you know, your visibility is really, really, really bad. The so one thing I like to do with the, with the um, when it comes to scramblers is I find the closest one. 
hitting the command centers over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing uh, the command center is somewhere over here. Or, actually, no, that, 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 that's where the command center is. That's the command center's location. Right. So, um, you, you try and find um, the quickest path to the command center. And the quickest path is usually the, um, Oh, wait, ah. no, go back, go back to the dock. Just go back to the dock, you. Okay. Carry on, get moving again. Alright, so the carrier is just, you know. Let's see, um. Repairs. Nothing really going on with repairs. Let's go to. Still do some directives now. Another thing you can actually do is launch the Manta, launch the Manta somewhere, and then have the um, carrier follow behind it or something like that. Kind of acting as a um, as a buffer. Anyway, try the scrambler over. Here. Let's see if there's a scrambler over here I can get rid of. The of the ship. Is there a scrambler there? Okay, they're not scramblers. The um, those circles I was talking about, those are not scramblers. But uh, see that. Back up a little bit. Uh, all right, I might actually. No, wait. I don't want you going, I don't want you actually targeting the enemy. Oh, wait. Two, engaged enemy. There we go. Yeah, great. Go attack order, attack target. Now I know what my target is, I can... Now I know where the target is, I can engage. Hopefully. Six of range. Alright, I have to put a scrambler as well. Into two, 
that's probably a scrambler. Look, turn the carrier around. So far, nothing's going on. Such are the hazards of taking over an island with scramblers. No idea where the enemy is. Uh, let's see, what kind of supplies, what kind of supplies do I need? I'll bring those, I'll bring the armor over. I'll bring a fuel pack, I'll bring a fuel pack. Seven meters. You don't want to get too close when it says uh, when it says that. That's a bit, that's a bit too low. Two. Right. So, point. Say waypoint or something like that. Like it's really like a waypoint or something. Just saying, hey, where you are, this is where they scramble and may may or not be, may may or may not be. What you engage, you'd be like, yep, okay. I can hit it. I'd hit that. Probably not, actually. Oh, here we go. Hey, knock, knock. And... Okay, the group of me here. Oh, there's a scramble. There was a scrambler. Die, meat sack. Die, you foolish meat sack. Take out enough, not all the rest, enough to just need to take out enough to uh, cause the enemy to uh, question their decision. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's an anti aircraft gun. Don't do not want. And I got my wish granted. I did not want it, and what happened to it? It vanished. Alright, we're approaching enemy range, and now we're out of enemy range. I think... I think that might be the Manta Garage. Attacking target. Target attacking. Attacking! Don't want any unexpected surprises, or expected surprises. Really much of a surprise, but it's like 
bit of a surprise supposed to be kind of expected, unexpected. So saying, you know, unexpected surprise, like for a department of redundancy department, you don't need to say unexpected surprise, because the whole idea of surprise is you're not expecting it. Whereas an expected surprise is also is an oxymoron. Right. Looks like uh, Group One may be able to get. It looks like the carrier may, may be closer now. All right. So I did a little scan over, the, like I did a little recon sweep of the area, and um, it appears it appears the Rambler. Oh, my box arrived. Well, I'll take forever to get there. I how zippy it actually was. So this thing is raining cats and dogs, is it? Well, I, as I said, I can solve the problem. I can solve any problem. I can solve all problems. Problems can be easily solved with the uh, judicious application of firepower. Can I hit it from here now? Am I leaving telemetry range? No? I'm pretty much out of telemetry range. Two, under attack. Shooting at me, no, just three, I guess. What's that, what's that, what's that, what's that? What's that? What's that, what's that, what's that? What do you target? Is the target illuminated? Target clear. Why am I done with this thing yet? This won't take damage. I'm aiming at shadows here. Okay, I'm gonna head. I'm gonna head. Take this thing back to base. I'm gonna move the carrier, like, I'm gonna wait for me to two, get in there, then I'll move the carrier down here. So I'm, I'm not getting anywhere with that scrambler. Really, I'm not getting anywhere. So it looks like I will have to destroy them all. Get moving, get, get moving there, carrier. I just give the carrier a name, like, every ship needs a name. Now, another thing you can actually do in this, um, in these scrambler missions is, you can't ever just throw them all in the early game because you, don't, you have to go you have to go the long way around. But in a later in later levels, you get this thing you get the um, you get the vehicle the vehicle grip. So so you can turn a man into a carry all. So a carry all kind of I don't think a carry all can use guns, but you can pick up units. So you destroy enough scramblers around the around the local area so that you can at least. So you can at least fly in the um you can like throw like one or two scramblers nearby to the command center, then you airlift in the um the hacking the hacking walrus, drop it off and then hack the command center without having to go through all the scramblers. Which is a brilliant strategy, but you know you have you have to have the carry all grip, you have to have the um carry all grip or whatever it's thing you've got to have the Lifting Alright, nothing else needs repairs. What guns do we have? Still only have three guns. Yeah, you kinda get a fourth one as the arm as like the um Yeah, so there's like only three guns and a plasma gun. Later on, those can be upgraded to black. 
generally be used because it's black. I mean, come on. Got a couple lot of black in this. Alright, I think I'm close enough to uh, launch. Launch all Great Justice. Great Justice, take off every Manta. Alright, target in range. And if not, I'll make it in range. Great Justice. For my ancestors. That's the way, sir. Telemetry That's range the way, uh -huh, increased. Uh-huh. I deactivated. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's the way, uh-huh. Uh-huh. It goes down. Yeah. Yeah, I love the lasers. So overpowered. So powerful. I'm say overpowered, but... These, these are my go-to. Next missile, the plasma gun. Actually, no, I don't even use plasma gun. Nice and powerful. That's the soldier. Alright, and that's another one. Who's that? Alright, so that scrambles down. The next one is uh, located over there. So I guess one of the things the game was actually like, trying to do was, um, you don't move, like, you, you, you put the carrier in a certain position, then you've got to work your way inland. But, you know me, I don't work inland. I don't make inroads of things. Full speed ahead! Full speed ahead! We're not going around. Whoa. We might actually. Collision! Collision impact! Maybe that's why they wanted me to go around. Collision impact! Alright, I understand. <laughs> yeah. By the way, don't give me, don't have me command a carrier. <laughs> don't make me fly, don't make me command a carrier. I tend to, you know, not, not use it correctly. So I have to use expensive military hardware. Alright, we're in range, let's go. Last stand, last shot. Last shot. Hello, boys! I'm deactivating your scrambler. Nice job, sir. We have full telemetry range. You should have no difficulty in reaching the command center now. Great. The command center is now going to be under my control. Once I deal with these annoying little pests on the ground. With my lasers. Alright. Okay. Maybe that's a bit too ambitious. But that's a bit too ambitious, so... I'm going to find where the um, quickest route to the enemy base is. Here, actually, never mind. Never mind. So let's see. I'll take that. Number seven. Number eight. Move out. And unit six also move out. Everyone roll out. Uh, I'll launch number nine as well. Target engaged. Target acquired. Give me a target. Alright, looks like we're getting closer. 
Launcher, what do you expect? Is that full telemetry range though? I can, um, I can destroy everything. Oh, shoot! Oh, got me, got me in here, Crack Gun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Elevate, elevate, elevate. Alright, slow down. Elevate again. So those turrets are, um, making sure to the aircraft. The ground installation. And then ground installation. Your auto run to ground. Pounding lasers into them. Laser. This laser is legit. Yeah, this laser is this laser is legit. Thanks. All right, so number seven, six, you assist. Uh, number six, assist. And number nine, assist. You're all assisting number seven. And you slowly make your way up to the um. Slowly make your way through the enemy, enemy position. You alright? Good what the lollygagging. Well, that is. Probably don't like it. Yeah, it looks to be funny. And I don't like it when they look at me funny. Okay? It's like, oh, you've got a laser, have you? Well, I don't like the look of your laser, and I'll be like, dude! Dude, I'll give him this laser, okay? It's not like I can change it, it's a laser. Well, actually, yes, I can change it, but... You know, I like this laser. I was born with this laser. I identify with this laser. I am not changing my weapon... I'm not changing my... My weapon orientation just to satisfy your... To satisfy your... Your social construct. Or something, I don't know. No, I didn't know where I was going with that one. Oh, I like one. Is that, for the, is that for the walrus? Is that for the manta? Ah! Damn it, it's just another armor oh, oh, mark one for this. Freaking walrus. Uh, 
steps over there. Heading over here. Execute orders six, um, so nine, nine, drop. Saving the game here. Right, moving in. Morris 9, you're on. There's a repair bay over there we can, we can take. Although repair 
Gonna send the uh, Manta in. For War of Seven. Now, War of Manta Two. So get moving. Okay, let's see. War of Nine. Move up here. War of Six. We're resisting Nine. Manta 2, move in. Well, actually, before I'm moving in that way, just 7 for a second, just disable that one turret there. I'm pretty sure that one turret is not going to be There we go, turret destroyed. Oh, ow, 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 quad cannon, quad cannon, quad cannon. Alrighty then, start hacking. Commence the hacking procedures. 
four or six, you're no longer needed. Um, yeah. Carrier, move in. Sir, I managed to extract the resource center access to the command. Right, we may find a useful weapon or upgrade construction weapons there. What we get? Sir, we gained a blueprint of a special upgrade for our units. Oh! It should improve their mobility in harsh conditions. This upgrade will be useful on Arctic. Ah, good. We're heading to the Arctic, I think, in, um, on the next area. But for the moment, I think um, this is a good time to cut the video off because I'm Stars RJ and I've seen the scales in the favor of um, in the favor of UE, the United Earth Coalition. Signing off.